What's good YouTube, it's Stud HD coming to you guys with a brand new video and today in this video I have a way for you guys to make 25,000 coins or just get some free training. Now inside of our unopened packs we do have an unopened player and I will show you that in a second but if you guys are new to the channel and like coin making methods, the Bengals theme team or even gameplays definitely subscribe and put on post notifications. But now let's go ahead and get into this video. So as you can see on screen we have the Superstar KO College Football Hayden now this is a Joe Hayden card he is a hundred percent for free now before I open that pack I do want to show you how you guys can actually get this player so if we head over to the main menu inside of superstar KO if you guys head into the game mode it says get three sacks and you guys will get an 85 overall cornerback Joe Hayden for the Pittsburgh Steelers this is actually his first upgrade so if you guys are like a Pittsburgh theme team this is definitely a W because he's like a 79 overall gold I want to say let's go ahead and hop back into ultimate team so you can see how you guys can actually Actually make coins by doing this method so as we head over to the unopened packs and open up the superstar ko college football hate impact you will see that this card for one you get a collectible so this superstar ko collectible is supposed to be a card art for joe hayden so that's kind of cool but let's go ahead and click on the card. And as you guys can see, it sells for 335 training. You can't put it in the sets, nothing like that. But I'll tell you what to do with that in a second. As you guys can see, he has 85 speed, 87 acceleration, 88 jumping, 80 zone coverage, and 82 man, as well as 84 press. So he's not the greatest card in the world, but hey, it might be good for people who don't have many corners. I mean, you could probably put him at corner three. I don't think he's gonna get beat over top and you're looking at about 87 speed. So it's not too bad, especially on a theme team. But if you you were to quick sell you guys can actually get 335 training now what are we gonna do with that training so i'm gonna be honest i don't think i'm much quick sell him but here's what you can do and if you guys go to the store and go over to training there is actually a pack in the store called campus heroes power up fantasy pack now it is 50 training now i've already opened up one of them mainly because i needed it for the shipley gameplay that i did a couple days ago but if you open up the pack most of these power ups or at least there's some power ups that are going for roughly seven to eight thousand reggie bush is cheap vince young he's actually going for eight thousand currently on the PlayStation market. The Matt Lineart, he is cheap. Same with Clay Matthews. I want to say one of the cornerbacks, I'm not mistaken, Philip Buchanan is kind of expensive. On trial rolls, like roughly 6K. Shipley at night is usually around 8K, but I'm not mistaken. I think I saw him up for 6K earlier today. Number one thing is, of course, open up this pack three times. If you guys were to pick a player that's roughly 7,000 coins, let's say you buy three of these packs and you pick, let's say, the Vince Young, because like I said, he was going for roughly 8K. So let's go ahead and go and auction this, and I can show you how many coins you can get for this. So he is selling for 8,200 coins. Now, I can't guarantee that's going to be for all of the players, but like I said, check the market, see which ones are going for that. So that is roughly 24,600 coins. Now, that, of course, is pre-tax, so you're probably looking at roughly like 22,000, somewhere in between there. Now, what can you actually do with the rest of the training? Well, you could actually go over to the base offense or the base defense because with the 335 training if you were to spend the 150 by buying three of those campus heroes packs you guys can actually open up the base offense or the base defense fantasy pack for the playbooks one time now inside of this of course it's an offense or a defense playbook and if we go over to the auction you can actually make roughly nine to ten thousand depending on the playbook that you pick of course you don't have to obviously buy this you could just save the training this is definitely a way to get more coins so by going to the playbooks and if we filter down by team i'm not mistaken with the raiders being one of the meta playbooks roughly nine thousand for the defense it is eleven thousand for the offense so you're looking at twenty four thousand plus another eleven thousand so you're roughly looking at 30, 31, 32,000 after tax. So that's actually not bad at all, especially for only getting three sacks. Now, I will say, highly recommend running Engage 8 to get sacks. Absolutely incredible play. It works almost every single time. We can go and look at some other playbooks. I'm not mistaken, the Jags is a good playbook. They're roughly 8,900, but I think that's more of a snipe. It's roughly 9,000, so not too bad. I'm not mistaken, the Rams are a decent one out here. 9,000, their defense is 10,000. So a lot of these playbooks are going for quite a bit and considering you get this player for free considering you get the 85 overall joe hayden for free it's definitely nice to know that you could make 
some decent coins by buying those three players inside of the store and of course buying a playbook and selling it as well now if you do have multiple farm accounts let's say you have five accounts which is the max total you're looking at roughly 150,000 coins for free that's not gonna mean the title not gonna click bet y'all on that but hey it's a free 30,000 coins if you guys are interested but with that being said guys make sure to like subscribe put on post notifications if you guys did like this video let me know if this method actually helped you make coins but with that being said guys have a great rest of your day I'm out. Peace.